Hey guys, welcome to the channel, taking a bathroom. The bathroom is the only place where you can play your gadgets in peace. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Also hit that bell notification so you can be up to date with all of our latest videos. So you out there in YouTube land, guys, just wanted to do a quick video, throw up the green screen, and talk about the little file ills. Let's jump right into it. Alright guys, so here we have it. This is the box. Nice little presentation. Let's go ahead and open it up. The box feels pretty good too. So yeah, you got these little illustrations. You got the name Lil File. 1.5 charging time. 10 hours of playback time. 300 hours of standby time. I mean, absolutely amazing, man. So it, it only take an hour and a half to charge this right out the box. And it's designed like an eel. Have a quick look at the box again on the outside of the box. Look in the back. Nice graphics. Love that. Very modern. Popping out. Let you know that you can use it for jogging, um, hiking, or whatever. Driving. So let's get back to the main event. Go ahead and put this little tab off the side. Get to the headphone. And just take my time to get this out. Guys, these are IPX67. Now, I have a whole playlist of water-resistant um, headphones and Bluetooth speakers. And most of them are IPX7 or IPX6. This is IPX67. So, this is definitely waterproof, not resistant. Go ahead and open up this little goodie bag. And basically, inside of here, you're going to have like these little earbuds, ear tips to put on the headphones so i always say you guys our ears are not created equally so these will make sure that you can adjust for a perfect fit to your pacific ear and they have an extra cable management clip right there to help manage your cable all right got that put that to the side what else we have up in here you have like this little cheat sheet right here Telling you how to pair it up quickly. Now, I did review a pair of these headphones before. But this is the new generation of the um, Lil File Eels. And so, this is telling you that um, it's a little faster pairing. And it's telling you exactly how to pair it up. So, go ahead and put that to the side. Have a look at our manual. Nice little small manual right here, guys. Just go ahead, look through it, flip through it. I mean, it's not rocket science. It's just Bluetooth headphones. But you want to make sure if you're having any trouble pairing it, refer back to your manual before you contact the company. Because that's what happens to us a lot of times. We just don't read the manual. And also, we have a micro USB cable to go with it. And they also have some type of cable management scrap right here. So that's very good to keep your um, headphones nice and neat. You have that little cable management scrap right there. Now, they feel just like the last ones I reviewed. Very light. Got that rubber feeling to it. Rubber paint job feeling to it. Very flexible, which it needs to be. When I throw it in a gym bag, it have to be very flexible. It have to be very light. So, yeah, I can ball this up and throw it in my gym bag. Right here, you have your spot for your um, micro USB charger. Just go ahead and place it in there. Have you, uh, it's labeled right and left. That's the other side, the little labeling. So, yeah, they, they made it easy for you. The buttons are very tactile, responsive. Man, they, they feel good. I, I got to be honest, they feel good. Let's have a look at the earbuds themselves. Let's see if I can get a closer look at them so you guys can see exactly how the um, earbuds are going to your ear look. Let's see if I can get it to focus. All right, focus focus it's always a challenge whenever you're using two different cameras so uh but yeah so i, I try my best guys hopefully you got a closer look at that nice thin wire but the flexibility and the weight is the selling point for me on this besides the ipx67 so take your bluetooth enabled device go ahead and make sure your bluetooth is turned down then you want to go ahead and put it in search Oh, uh, man, I got all these notifications. I got to swipe off right quick. Hold on, people. All right, I think I got it. So, got my Bluetooth turned on. Let me go ahead and power up the headphone. Get the camera to focus back on it. So, we're going to press and hold down the power button for about two to three seconds. And it should alternate 
white and red. Now, usually it's blue and red on headphones, but they went a different route and did it white and red. I don't know if you guys can see it. They go alternating white and red right there. So the headphones are in the pairing mode. Once again, make sure my Bluetooth is in search. It's going to find it. All right, they found it. Press it. Now, this new generation is supposed to pair faster than the old generation. And voila, we pair it just that fast. So, yeah, this is way faster than the other little file eels that I had. So, let's give them a listen. See what we're working with, people. Take my cell phone and let's see. Open up Amazon Music. Or should I open up Google Play? Nice sound as always. Sound just like the other generation. Let me see. Waiting for the bass to drop. Yeah, bass drop. Very deep bass. Nice, clear highs. Excellent mid. I mean, you really can't hear that sound, man. So, all right. So, that's good and all. But, they say that this is IPX67. Again, which is not water resistant, but waterproof. All right, guys. Let's see if they live up to their claim. So, IP67 just happened to have this random bowl of water right here. Go ahead and move my Note 8 phone. The best phone on the planet. Samsung, if you're listening. Sponsorship wouldn't hurt. All right, let's go ahead and take the headphones, prepare them, and we just want to put them in the water. Just go swoosh them around and take them out and see if they're still playing. Let it marinate for a little while. All right, I think it's ready to come out. Let's have a listen. Still playing. <laughs> still playing. Look at that, man. Wow, go ahead and put them back in there. Let's see, let's see what's gonna happen now. Let it marinate again, let it marinate again. Putting it through the test, let's try it again. And it's still playing, people. Look at that, still playing. Wow, let's transition back. That's freaking awesome, man. Yep, they're a little wet, but they still sound good. All right, guys, so that's about it. Like I said, we already did a thorough review. I'm going to put the link to our first review in the description of this video. But this is the new generation right here. This is the newer generation, faster pairing. IPX67, guys, you've seen it with your own eyes. Submerge it in water, still plain, still sound good as when we first paired it up when it was totally dry. So, guys, thank you for coming to my bathroom, having reviewed my gadgets. Until next time, it's your boy taking the bathroom. Don't forget to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Peace.